Hello friends, welcome to Leg Life. And you probably can immediately tell based on Sherry's ears, her spirit jersey, my captain's wheel shirt, and my steamboat Mickey hat that today we are talking about Disney Cruise Line, one of our favorite, favorite subjects ever. Yeah. And this is a video that thank God we get to make. <laughs> yeah. Because you guys, we finally have word that our viewer cruise next month is actually sailing. Today's video is all about it. We made a podcast recently kind of talking about this, like the emotional roller coaster that this has been with the is it, isn't it kind of thing. Um, we will actually post that down below. Yeah, the viewer cruise is like two years plus in the making since we very mm -hmm. first announced the first one. And then of course, because of COVID it got canceled, we rebooked thinking, a year away, 13 it'll be months fine. away, it should be fine. No problems at all. And then we didn't know until recently that the cruise actually was happening. Uh, we are cruising on the Disney Wonder on October 18th out mm -hmm. of San Diego. And the Disney Wonder just recently moved through the Panama Canal and headed west. It is in San Diego. And so our cruise is a go. Is a go. And I think it is the third or fourth cruise back on the Disney Wonder, yeah. which is super super exciting. Mm -hmm. So let's give you some details about the cruise. It is a four night cruise, a Mexican cruise out of San Diego. We will have two at sea days and one stop in Cabo San Lucas. Uh, we're really excited about it. We've actually done this itinerary before yep. and we really loved it. Mm -hmm. um, our plan is to not get off the ship in Cabo. Right. I think we're basically going to spend the entire cruise on the ship yeah. because, well, honestly, it's the ship that we've missed. Right? We haven't been able to be on the ship in... 21, 22 months? And so, Ugh. like, that's <laughs> where we want to be. Yeah. In fact, like, I always joke at the end of our cruises that I'm going to hide away, like, a castaway and, like, stow away in the stateroom. I might not be joking this I'm time. I'm not leaving. Like, if Disney's watching, <laughs> you may want to have extra security on the Wonder because I'm going to have to be, like, drugged and then drug off of the drug. ship to get me. Is it dragged? I think it's dragged. I'm not so great with the grammar. A surprise to no one. <laughs> um, but we're so excited. Yes. When it, Okay. I don't want to go over too much of the stuff we talked about on the podcast because you guys can listen to that. Mm -hmm. But... This has been such a strange cruise because most of the time, in fact, every other time we've booked with Disney, from the second you make your reservation, it is just like this building anticipation and countdown. And planning and like preparing. And this one has just been so different, especially the second cruise, because it wasn't this building anticipation. If anything, it was like building question. Well, and like not allowing ourselves to to have really any hope mm -hmm. that this was good, it was actually going to happen true. because we just, I mean, we had so many trips canceled last year that we were just like, we don't want to build any anticipation in ourselves and then just be let down again. And we're kind of struggling with that <laughs> a little bit, even right now, because even though Disney has said the ship is sailing, the cruise is a go, uh, we booked our plane tickets. Uh, there is this like little voice in the back of my head that's like, yeah, but what if? Like, yeah. what if something happens? What if you fail a test at the at the terminal? What if you, you know what I mean? Like all of the right. what ifs, um, because of what the world has been like the last two years, um, yeah. I just don't want to let myself be let down again. <laughs> and so- It's gonna happen though. It's gonna happen. And we're so excited. And that's what we want to talk about yeah. in this video. Um, now let's talk about the viewer cruise aspect of it. Mm -hmm. So I, I didn't think, first of all, anybody would ever sell with us, right? When we first announced it. Right. And then after the first one was canceled, I was like, well, certainly nobody's gonna rebook in the middle of a pandemic. And then so many of you guys <laughs> booked. And then um, as COVID continued, I thought certainly everybody's gonna cancel. And then when everybody didn't cancel and Disney announced it was sailing, I was like, I wonder if there's even anybody left. There is. Mm -hmm. And people are continuing to book, actually. So we have over 70 people <laughs> right now who are cruising with us. Yeah. Uh, we have over 30 staterooms of Leg Life viewers that are going with us, which is, um, it's less than half of what it was at its peak, for sure. Right. But that is still... Understandably. But that is still more people than I thought would ever cruise with us. Right. So I'm so excited. <laughs> we know it's going to look different. Uh, yeah. We know that it will be a different experience than we anticipated, but we're going to get to spend time with you guys on a Disney cruise ship. Yep. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. And it's in like just over a month. Yeah. Which is really weird. Which is super weird. And we were just talking about it earlier tonight. We were like, 
there's things that we usually already have in place, like making sure we have things like that we're going to need for the cruise, yeah. um, outfits and whatever. And even just like this past weekend, we were like, do I have a swimsuit? Yeah, like, that's I right. Don't... He doesn't yet. Like... <laughs> no, none of my, sh I've lost so much weight that none of my shorts fit me. And I'm like, oh yeah, we're going on a Disney cruise in a month. Right. Like we're going to have to get you some swim trunks. Like it's, I mean, it's just that kind of stuff that we're like, it's a month away. And we have, we've done zero preparing because we didn't even know if it was going to happen until yeah. like a week ago. And so, so now <laughs> it feels like, it feels like we're trying to play catch up. Yeah. Whereas all of our other Disney cruises, we've been able to be way ahead of planning. And it's like, oh man, right. we're really ready for this. Now it's kind of like, oh my gosh, we have so much to do. We have so much to do. It's a little bit insane. But I don't know. It's kind of fun. And yeah. I've been watching a lot of like Disney cruise vlogs. And so the excitement is building. Yeah. The thought of us just being back on board. Um, <sighs> as far as the kind of things that we're going to be doing on board, honestly, we just want to do the things that we love. I like, just want to be on the ship. I don't even yeah. care. Like, I mean, part of me is just like, I don't care if like nothing is available. Like if I just have to like sit on deck the whole time i don't care that i'm, I'm on ship and i'm i don't that's all i want i have a drink of the day Get me and on i'm ship, sitting on the ship drink of the day and i'm good and that's exactly like, right. That's all I need. <laughs> so we're going to hang out with our Lug Life community. We're going to get to meet yeah. a lot of you guys and hang out, which we're super excited about. Um, we are going to put a video up on Friday. You guys are getting two Disney Cruise videos this week. Yeah. Um, because as we were talking about the cruise, we realized that there are some things that we do every cruise. Mm -hmm. But then there are also some things that it seems like every time we get off the cruise, we're like, dang it, we well, forgot to do this again. Which is something that we do every cruise as well. We're always like, yes. <laughs> ah, we wanted to do this. Every cruise, we have a list of things that we forgot <laughs> to do. Yeah. And so on Friday, we're actually going to talk about that, like things that we want to remember to not forget. Correct. And we actually made a list in our phones <laughs> so that we have the list with us at all times and so we can just be like, have we done this yet? Fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Sherry, um, yeah. as you think about the viewer cruise, what's the thing that you're most excited about now that we know that it's happening? Okay, well, I'm excited about getting on the ship, but I'm also so excited to see our peoples. Yeah. I... To meet some of our new peoples and to, like, hang out with other people that, like, the Zaglins that we love. Like, I'm just, I'm so excited just to, like, be with our people. That, that for me, 100% <laughs> is it. And we said this in, I think, Monday's vlog because we got to meet some viewers uh, that were visiting Anchorage. Mm -hmm. There are so many of you guys that we've gotten to know and connect with through YouTube comments and through live streams and through yeah. all that stuff that it's strange to us to be like, wait a second, we've never met, right? Like this person. Yeah, like there's some people I'm just like, oh yeah. I've, I've never met you. <laughs> and a lot of them are on this cruise. Mm -hmm. And so it's going to be really fun to be like, okay, now I've actually met you. Yeah. You know, and so that, that's one of the things I think, I think that is definitely the thing I'm most excited about. To be able to put like a real face with a name, like not, not just like your picture or your avatar, but like an actual face. I'm so excited. Can't wait. Absolutely cannot <laughs> wait. So the viewer cruise is happening. Uh, over 70 people are booked to go on it with us. Mm -hmm. uh, we are going to stay on the ship the entire time. Mm -hmm. um, it is a Halloween on the High Seas cruise. We are bringing costumes. Yeah. We've never done that on a Halloween on the High Seas cruise before. No. So I'm very excited. Mm -hmm. uh, we know this cruise will look different. And so we are going in to this cruise with, um, with just completely different expectations than any other cruise we've gone on. Honestly, really low expectations. Um, mm -hmm. Just because I don't know, I don't really know what to expect. I, we've watched a bunch of um, like the new Disney vlogs of people that have gone on yep. very recent ones. And so I kind of have an idea, but I also just don't really know really what it's going to be like. So for me, there are three things that if these three things happen, expectations met. You know what they are? Banana soft serve. Banana soft serve. <laughs> Shocking. Me being on the ship. And our people. Well, if I get those three things, anything else that happens is a bonus. What if the saucer machine is down? I will throw myself over the edge of the <laughs> ship, swim to shore, <laughs> buy banana soft serve, swim back, crawl up the side of the ship, and sit on deck with my own banana soft serve. Okay. Right, well. Deal? Sure. I'm probably not going to do that. <laughs> Let's be really honest. Um, yeah, I. it's so weird, you guys, that the cruise is happening. We... Just just real talk, if we had to bet money two months ago. One month ago. One month ago, we would have said, I don't think it's gonna happen. I don't think it's gonna happen. I think it's gonna get canceled. I don't I don't see how it's gonna happen. Right. 
and now it's going to happen. Yeah. And I, I kind of love that the first ship back after all of the chaos of the world is our favorite Disney cruise ship, the Wonder. Yeah. Like we get to go back on our, on that, our favorite, our favorite ship. Also, one of the reasons that I'm so happy it is happening is that we have a streak that we get to continue with Disney Cruise. Yeah. Our first Disney Cruise was in 2015. Yeah. We also cruised with Disney in 2016. We cruised with them in 2017. We cruised 2018. We cruised 2019. We cruised 2020 in 2020, which not many people got to. January 2020. Because we cruised in 2020, yeah. and now we will get to have cruised in 2021. Yes. And so seven years in a row, we've been able to cruise with Disney. Mm -hmm. Even through a global pandemic that shut down this entire industry, we will not have missed a year. Right. That's so cool. Right. <laughs> like, that is so cool. So part of me is also just like, we are going to make this happen. It's going to happen. <laughs> it's going to happen. We're going on this because we've got to keep our streak alive. Right. So, friends, we just want to let you know, uh, if your cruise is happening, so you guys are going to have cruise vlogs coming up in, like, just over a month. Yes, the trip itself is going to look a little bit differently than what we had initially planned. That's exactly, our whole trip in general. The whole trip. Yep. Because we had planned on going down a few days early and maybe doing a park, maybe not. I don't or know. doing, like, we, we talked about doing like a meetup in or Disneyland. Meet up. Yep. Yep. Um, and then staying after the cruise for like four or five days and just doing like a you and me thing. Yep. Um, we're not doing either sides of that. We are flying down um, like with a day to spare um, before mm -hmm. the cruise and we we're flying back the day after. Yeah. So it's going to be a pretty quick trip for us uh, for a number yep. of reasons. We just, you know, in the current. Um, just kind of climate of everything. We thought, you know what, let's go down, let's do this, and um, then let's get back home. Yep. Right, so that's yep. exactly what we are going to do. Um, we are also cruising with a number of other vloggers. There's a lot of Leg Life community members that have their own channels. Yeah. And so we're gonna have a video before our cruise that actually highlights all of their channels. Yeah, we're gonna Be talk about all of the channels. We're gonna list them out for you so you can all follow all of them. Yep, one of our goals in the Leg Life Viewer Cruise is, is not just to, you know, create more cruise content, but to get, to get to meet you guys, but also to get to like lend our platform to the Leg Life community who is also creating content. Yeah. Um, and we think it will be fun for you guys to watch the Leg Life Viewer Cruise from all these different perspectives. Yeah, you're gonna have a bunch of different angles. And so I love that. So yeah. I would just ask you in advance um, that when we put out that video, I would love it if you would support those channels. Um, yes, the people who are going on this have supported us like crazy and it would mean the world to us to be able to uh, support them. And one of the ways yep. you can do that is by subscribing to all of their channels. Yeah, and I'm, watching their videos. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to watch all their videos. I'm so excited. I shared on a live stream earlier, <laughs> one of the comments that we get after most of our cruises is that there's people who will message us and be like, hey, I was on your most recent cruise, um, and I just wanted to say how cool it was to relive our cruise experience through your videos. Right. And I think that's a cool thing that people do that. But we've never gotten that experience <laughs> to like relive our cruise through somebody else's vlogs. Right. And so I'm excited to like relive our cruise through yeah. Justin and Lacey's videos and through Laura's videos and through the Miller's videos and just all of these of our channels yep. that are gonna be with us. Yes. Oh my gosh, I'm getting excited. Yeah. I cannot wait. I'm so excited. So friends, <laughs> if there are questions that you have, if there are things that you want to see in these videos, mm -hmm. if there are just things that you're wondering about cruising right now in this climate, uh, let us know in the comments below because obviously, you know, our goal is to inspire, inform, and do good, right? Yep. Those are the three things. And on Disney Cruise videos, we hope that we're able to inspire you to get out and travel and see the world and experiences and do things that make you smile and happy and probably cry tears of joy. There were for sure reason those. But then also, when it comes to informing, just to help your future Disney cruises maybe be a little more educated with right. things that we share. So you can enjoy it more. Exactly. Yeah. So, if there are things you guys want to know, let us know. We can prepare for that stuff in advance. Friends, we cannot wait to bring you along on our next Disney cruise. This would be Disney cruise number seven for us, mm -hmm. which is pretty cool. Yeah. Cannot wait. Back on the Disney Wonder. Drinks the day in hand. Ugh. Mickey waffles being shoved into my face. <laughs> The black truffle pasta appetizer. Oh, goodness gracious. Escargot. The beignets at Tiana. Yeah. More drinks of the day. Banana soft serve. Another, another, another drink, drink of the day. Of the day. Right. And we're bringing you guys along for all of it. <laughs> Leg life, family, community, friends. We love you guys so much. Um, 
Thank you for making all of this possible for us. Thank you for joining us on all of our travels and all of our adventures. And we're so excited to bring you with us to Mexico on the Disney Wonder in one month. That's so weird. Friends, we'll see you on the next Lug Life video on Friday when we tell you the things that we want to remember to not forget. Fingers crossed on this cruise. Bye, friends.